Hey, hey, hey! So it is Wednesday, and we are um, celebrating our anniversary a few days late. So we're going to be going to Waco, going to Duncan first, and because that's really the whole reason we're going to Waco. Just for just for Duncan. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we're going to go to Duncan, and then probably we're going to go to the Dr Pepper Museum there. There's the Dr Pepper Museum. We've wanted to go for a while, so. Yeah, it's gonna be a fun day, and then we'll see what else we're gonna do. So. Yay! Yeah! So we're at Duncan! <laughs> <laughs> we got some croissants and some croissants. Co croissants <laughs> and some, uh, some coffee. So. Starting out our day here. Pretty excited about it. This is gonna be great. Hi. We got our sandwiches. It took a long time. It took a long time. Um, yeah, so we got them. <laughs> we got our sandwiches. Okay, we just got done at Dunkin' Donuts. Mm -hmm. We're on the road again. Mm -hmm. And so we have coffee and we don't want to take it in anywhere because most places won't let you. So we decided that anytime we come to um, Waco, we want to go to Magnolia's and we want to eat at a food truck because then we can say that we've ate at yes. all the food trucks that are there so we're just gonna go there and walk around for a while last time we went we got the pizza like a, it was a food, pizza fruit truck oh we both got our own pizzas it was so good it was delicious oh so good we had a we had a pretty mediocre uh duncan experience it was just, we did it was just not that great uh, the lady that took our order was like uh, i don't know if it was her first day or what but she didn't know what she was doing. And then, Which was totally fine. We fine. understand that. I, I get that. Um, but but the poor girl probably hadn't been trained at all. Yeah. Because she didn't know how to use the stuff at all. Yeah. Which I felt bad for her. It's pretty rough. And sink. So like, since I work at Chick Fil A, like I just I notice those things a lot more, and you can just tell like she was not trained at all. I just felt really bad because I've been in that spot before, but I had training, so that helped. So we didn't really eat very much, so we are a little hungry, I think. Yeah. A little. A little bit. A wee bit. These are pretty. So pretty. Love those. Metal plates or wood plates. Look at how huge. This is my dream sink. Dream sink right here. How yeah. massive this is. Awesome. So we're up here. We're gonna go up. We can go this way yeah, or up. We have our map. We have a map. On the map. Ooh. That's cool. What are the Oh yeah, that's 
that's super cool. Dr. J.M. Witt Office. <laughs> that's cool. Wait, wait, what? Oh god, oh wow. There are many of these new concoctions like the color flavors back then. You guys. Speaking of flavors, <laughs> I'm proud of one I did over at the phone. Wow. I've been given that lots of credit for creating real. a He's new soda flavor. Right these days it's called Dr. Pepper. But back in the beginning, So we're on the second floor now, and this is what we came out to. We went up an elevator, the Dr. Pepper truck. Yeah. elevator in time and it closed on me this is a problem I get distracted <laughs> all right so now we are out of the actual like museum part and we just saw this it's like a steamer I think for uh, yeah. dr. pepper so used to be inside but now I think we're going into the gift shop right that's yes and we get drinks and stuff we got tickets and we get drinks yeah, so. so we're gonna go in there sweet drive this thing with like soda in it and sell Dr. Pepper. It's like a horse carriage. Yeah. Super neat. All right, so we are out of the museum and it was super awesome. We had a super fun time. And we got these like drink, the, the drinks with our drink tickets. So I got Dr. Pepper, she got root beer and they're Man, amazing. it's so much better than just regular like he soda at the store. Beer and he loves this. Yeah, it's actually really good. It's so so good. and it's the perfect size. Yep, just a tiny just little, a little bit. tiny little cup. We're so, excited. Yeah, we're super excited. Now we're about to go to this like market, I guess. I don't something. I don't know. So we're gonna check it out and then probably go back to Magnolia to eat some food. Yeah. We're going back. Yeah. We had to scope out food trucks earlier. Yeah. The market we came to. There's a pie peddlers. Look how cute this is. Everything is so sweet over here. And then I think we're gonna go in here. So now we're waiting on our brisket. Uh, well, my brisket sandwich, Delane got a pulled pork sandwich. So, just waiting on that at our 
this little food truck right behind me. But yeah, this has been so much fun. We've had such a good time. So, yep. Still got most of the day left ahead of us too. Yeah, boy. This is delicious. This is so freaking good. Mm. Good choice. Mm -hmm. As you just dropped some, I think, on your lap. No. Yeah. It was both. Okay, so we are now at our next location, which is the mall, Richland Mall. And we're just gonna go. We, there's the H&M in here, so we're gonna go in there. Probably find some clothes for us that are- Sorry it's so loud. Our ears cheap. on like full. Yeah, our ears on full blast. It's hot, it's hot today. But it's like it's perfect, like swimming water. What water? Swimming water. Swimming water. Swimming water. <laughs> it's perfect swimming water. Mm hmm. Places. Oh. <laughs> oh god. He said, I wanna try this. It's like it's for three minutes. I did like the cheapest one. Man, it's it's really nice. <laughs> Look how he's sitting. It's like <laughs> it's so intense. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't know if he's liking this or hating it. It's it's kinda nice. It's kinda nice. Is it doing your legs too? Yeah. And, and my backside. <laughs> it's doing everything. Oh, oh God. So we just had the strangest thing happen, but it's not that strange because <laughs> we were in the strange. mall. Yeah. Guys, you saw my hair earlier. It did mm -hmm. not look beautiful. <laughs> this guy selling things, of course, stopped me. Mm -hmm. And you, you know, like you, you, y'all know, like at malls. Those are the people you kind of avoid unless you're actually trying to buy something. And I can't say no. She can't say no. Like, I was gonna say, like, okay, so this guy pulled pulled us over. He's like, here, come on, come here, look at this. And I was like, I was trying to say, I, I, and then he just kept talking. And then she was just like, okay. No, I literally was just like. <laughs> she didn't say anything. Because he's like, you have beautiful hair. And in my head, I'm like, what a liar. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's like, everywhere. Yeah. So anyways. Got my hair straightened by a two hundred and fifty dollars straightener. Yeah, so he was gonna sell it to us for. He did a lot of trying to mm -hmm. sell us things, but he also I don't have my hair tie anymore. He took her hair tie. Not so. on purpose. I know he was not trying to, but, but. Well, my hair's down. But he straightened it, and it does, guys. It looks. It was a really nice straightener. Like he curled it with one of the wands, and then he straightened it, and it was straight immediately. So it was super nice. But also, I was like. Yeah. So it was a $250 straightener and he ended up bumping it all the way down to $100. Um, I, actually first he tried to sell us the wand, the straightener, and this other product and he said he'd give it to us for $250. Yeah. And then he took away one of the products and then bumped down the price. He's like, I'm going to give you my manager's deal. Yeah. Your manager's discount or whatever. Which I don't know if I buy that either. He's but. like, I really care about you. And I was like, <laughs> I was like bull crap. Nothing, but thank you sir <laughs> mm -hmm. so, so awkward we just don't have like you know a hundred dollars just to shell out you know so i mean i would have that was a nice strainer it, it but was. we didn't have a hundred dollars and also it was just really strange it was it we're gonna go somewhere else we got some things at h&m joseph got we only spent thirty dollars at h&m joseph got two pairs of pants and a shirt and i got a dress yeah thirty dollars so now we're gonna go to target i think Right? Yeah, to look at right. some maternity stuffs. So Yay. Yee. Alright, so our target run was a success. We got not for clothes. Not for clothes. But for shoes. Yes, I got my favorite shoes. And they had buy one, get one fifty percent off, so I got two pairs. Yeah. Yeah. And you were gonna show them? I just wear these shoes every day. 
if you know me, you know that that is true. I wear them every day. I got issues. All right, so now I think we're actually gonna be heading back to Temple. And then we're okay. gonna go eat somewhere for dinner, I think. Probably Roadhouse. So, excited, yay. <laughs> So we're home. We went and ate at Roadhouse, as y'all saw, and it was delicious. And now we're gonna do some house stuff, house chores. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be good. But thanks for watching, everybody. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.